Hello Capricorn, it's my lady from my lady's way tarot and I'm coming to do your weekly general reading in the week of May 23rd through the 30th, 2022. The cards I'm using today are Mer Oracle Mermaid, Oracle of the Mermaid cards by Lucy Cavendish and I'm closing off with my Miss Cleo Power Tarot deck by Miss Cleo. I want to thank everybody for like, sharing, subscribing, and setting up personal readings with me. All right, more foes. Let's get this show on the road. All right, what's going on with the Capricorn? All right, let's see what this is. All right, so we got the water flight card here. So this makes me feel like somebody is letting go, releasing some kind of burdens, okay? I'm letting it go, giving it, letting go the wheel. Let go the wheel, okay? Let the wheel go. All right, what's going on? What's going on? Ooh. All right, Um, I don't know if this has anything to do with this reading, okay? But I think retrograde is on its way back. But I feel like X, some X or something from your past, like not so fast, come back here, okay? So somebody about to have an X or something that they were doing coming back, okay? Yeah, it ain't over yet. Something is not over yet. All right. Yep. It's a homeland. Somebody's going back to somewhere they were. Um, maybe somebody was going on a journey, about to go on a trip, about to go somewhere. But I do feel like something from the past is holding you back or it's going to hold you back. Okay. Mm-hmm. All right. So we got the Coral Wisdom card reverse here. With this Coral Wisdom Reverse, this makes me feel like whatever this is, like if it's a relationship or just a situation that happened in a relationship, it had less than six months that's been going on. I heard three, so possibly closer to three months. Okay. The situation, whatever the situation is. Third party. Okay, so it looked like it was some third party situations going on here. Um, or somebody might have been doing some flirting. This person that was doing some flirting coming back, okay? You possibly in a relationship, you might be dealing with somebody in a relationship, but I do feel like something from the past is getting ready to come back, okay? Mm. So maybe it was just flirting around last time and then this person coming back now, and now they they they're gonna be a little more tougher, okay, a little more aggressive when it comes to uh that relationship okay for some of you this could have happened like six months ago but it's getting ready to start again okay all right so we got the song of the siren so i feel like somebody is not listening to the signs okay i do feel like you got signs coming from all over the place warnings stop don't go here don't go there don't do this don't do that this is about to happen that's about to happen somebody's not listening Okay, and I do feel like somebody may not be listening because I'm just trying to stay calm. I'm just trying to relax. I'm not trying to go there, but these are real messages. This is not you talking to yourself, okay? Because I do feel like other people are, are warning you about this too. Um, they could be warning you about a third party um, that somebody, that your person is doing, dealing with, okay? Like I saw this person over here and last time they was over there, you know, they were with, you know, so-and-so. Let's keep going. All right. So we got the freedom card. Yeah, I, I said that a second ago. Okay. Um, so somebody, some of you guys may have left this person because of a third party situation. But of course, it seems like somebody don't want to be free. Don't want to be away from this person. They coming back. Okay. They're coming back. I feel like somebody's only dealing with this person because they don't want to be alone. All right. They coming back with the baggage. Okay. I mean, they still got the same cheating ways. They ain't changed in six months, six years. They not going to change. Okay. Mm-hmm. I feel like either this is a third party situation. If it's not, I feel like, oh, I don't know. I just saw like a picture of Eeyore. Okay, most, I don't know, if you don't know who Eeyore is, that's like the, the donkey off uh, Winnie the Pooh. It's just like this person, no matter how awesome and great a situation is, this person is always 
dragging it down okay it's just like we in the middle of a party everybody having fun and then they start talking about in, in first grade when somebody uh stole they snack wrap I, I don't know it's like they always bring the energy in the building down okay it's either that or the cheating all right so we got the receptivity card okay so this card makes me feel like uh you might have blocked this person um, trying to stay away from this person. This could be the other way around. This person possibly blocked you. But I do feel like somebody getting ready to tear off that block or work their way around it, okay? I do feel like this person has been trying to get, in ho get a hold of you for a while. Um, wow. I hope, okay. I do feel like they are using different numbers, okay? So, I feel like you're calling these numbers back. Nothing's there, okay? I don't know if they do dial tones anymore, but... <laughs> There's nothing there when you call when you call this person back, okay? But I do feel like this person is trying to get around, and I do feel like this person is trying to come back to you. You could be trying to go back to this person, okay? All right, so we got the experiment card here. So this is how that person gets in. This person is a master manipulator, okay? This person is one of those manipulators that make you feel like you're doing the manipulating, and you end up apologizing, okay? So this is the kind of person that you're dealing with here. All right, so let's see what's going on with this Miss Cleo Power Deck. All right, let's see what's going on with the Miss Cleo Power Deck for the Capricorn. What's going on with the Capricorn? Strong energy here. Mm. Wow, okay, I don't know why. I just saw somebody shopping. <laughs> like, this this energy is really sh strong. I, it's crazy. It looked like somebody was shopping for cleaning products. I don't know. Let's keep going. All right, so we got the three of coins here. So this makes me feel like um, somebody might have worked with this person. Um, or this could mean somebody may have some bad recognition at work, okay, with this three of pentacles being reversed, okay? Mm-hmm. Okay. All right. So we got the eight of swords here. So it looks like somebody is, feels like they stuck in this situation. It's a, a mental trap. I do feel like if you really wanted to get out of this, you could. Okay. So it looks like somebody's still holding on to a negative person. A lot of times we do this because we feel like we can change and save this person. What's that song? What well, can't raise a man <laughs> or you can't raise a woman. Okay. These people, they stuck in their ways. Some somebody, some people need professional help. So everybody needs some of that sometimes. Mm-hmm. Shoot. Like somebody definitely stuck in their ways. All right, so we got the nine of coins reversed here. So I do feel like a lot of money or a lot of time has been lost in this situation. I did see um, somebody might have been locked up before. I feel like a lot of money went into this person getting out. Whether it be a mental lock or actual jail lock, I feel like it it cost it to get this person out. If it's not time or it's money, okay. So if you wanted to help this person, it's gonna cost a lot more than what it's worth. Okay, half the thing on the deck just flew out. All right, so we got the page of swords reversed here. Okay, so this makes me feel like, of course, this per this is like real stalking okay so somebody's doing some real stalking watching you you could be watching this person but i do feel like this person is watching and they trying to be on their way back trying to see when that door is open like i said this person is a manipulator okay so this person is gonna see the right time i know when to get in there and get this person okay so beware of that this person is definitely doing the the riding down the street okay like sitting on the next block stalking okay all right, let's see what's going on with this Eight of Swords. One card, please, for the Capricorn. Yes. So we got the Ace of Cups here. So even though that first, that person from the past, situation from the past is getting ready to try to come back and hold you back, I do feel like a lot of new beginnings are coming for you. I do feel like fulfillment. I do feel like success. I feel like happiness is on its way, okay? Mm-hmm. Definitely. You know what? That's the manipulators, too. They they see you happy and then they want a piece of that or they want to ruin that, okay? 
So that go back to this person might be Eeyore. Like, oh, let me let me go mess this up. It's like making people sad makes them happy. That's the only thing that makes them happy. Okay. Let's see what's going on with this nine of pentacles. One card, please. All right. So it's six of coins. So whatever you put into that situation with this previous person, you're not going to get it back. Okay. And I do feel like this person is coming to take things that you have, even if it's just happiness. Even if it's just happiness, this person wants a piece of that and they're not going to give you anything in return. It's just going to be a wasted waste of time. Okay. Let's see what's going on with this page of swords. It's crazy. I've seen these. I had friends, well, sort of con friends like this. Just did not like to see nobody happy. Then when you was down, they, they pulled out a knife and stabbed you while you was weak. All right. So we got the five of cups here. Look at that. So the five of cups is about loss. Okay. So this person is stalking you, trying to see if you're going to lose stuff. And it makes them feel strong and happy and all that good stuff. But if you succeed in like you are, this person wants to come try to ruin that, wants to come try to take that, okay? And this is what they're looking for. They're looking for you to fail. It's not happening. They need to try to, they're trying to make a way to happen, for that to happen, okay? It's crazy. Narcissists, of course, it's just like crazy how people feel like they made you. Like, I didn't have anything while we were together. When we left, when we broke up, when we separated, when I moved out of your house, that's when my life got better. So none of this that I have belongs to you, okay? Especially not this happiness, okay? But that's what this person thinks. All right, time to fight, okay? So we got the two of swords here. So I do feel like this person is getting ready to try to come back in. Of course, they're going to try to find their way around. Like I said, if you block this person, this person will make different accounts, okay? Um, but this person is coming. It's just all about how you're going to deal with them, Okay? Yep, so get ready, because here they come. Other than that, that's all I have for you guys. Make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. Thanks for watching.